Harry Massey, innovator, intergalactic wizard, humanitarian, philanthropist. Imagine a world where biochemistry-based healthcare isn't creating toxic side effects. Imagine a world where just through bioenergetic frequencies and information, we can stimulate and trigger the body's own innate healing capacity. He's brilliant, he's a massive visionary and innovator. He has basically gotten the world of bioenergetics out into the world where people can understand it and he's made it actionable where it's actually being used out in the world. If I'm trying to get myself better, I might as well be helping others to get better too. And wouldn't it be good if there was some sort of health system that could work out what was wrong with people from the comfort of their own homes and help them to get better too? I didn't realise it at the time, but that was my own choice point for starting to align my purpose. Yet, I was ill in bed, I didn't have a clue how to do it, and I had absolutely no money. However, an incredible set of coincidences started to happen, and I started to meet the right type of people who helped me on my journey. And so, as a scientist, I want to be involved with people who are skeptics, and, and they want real hard truth and answers to what they're pursuing. And what I found in Harry is that he's he's sure about what he's discovered, that he knows that there's a truth, and he wants to design the right experiment, the right way to do things. And, and he's one of these people, and, and these are elements of, of strong leaders, is they find people who make them stronger. Harry is a genius when it comes to the application of innovation into wellness. Uh, he has this unique blend of looking at the world in a uh, very data-driven and scientific way, but also having the entrepreneurial experience to actually make that into a profitable business. I know firsthand what it's like to be at rock bottom and severely exhausted, with constant pain, having full fibromyalgia, brain fog, low energy, exhausted fatigue. Now my case was so extreme that I was bedridden with chronic fatigue syndrome for seven long, long years. Life extension, restoring your energy, um, increasing your energy levels, and you've got some really fascinating ways to make that happen. Life is an energy exchange. And there's something more fundamental to health behind that. You figured out how to effectively record the equivalent of software for the body. That enables us to give like a you know much more instantaneous, um, true picture of your overall vitality. I know you've got three ways to heal the body that you talk about, and you're thinking about bigger things, more portable things, and getting even better with the software. He's a visionary. No idea is too big for him. Any idea, it seems, that you throw at Harry, it's possible. The question that many of us are asking is, how come we've got all of these technological solutions, we've got the people and the passion, how on earth is it that these solutions end up being blocked by the love of power? Whereas instead, wouldn't it perhaps be better if we could all get up, align our purposes, and come from the power of love to see these solutions through? Undoubtedly what makes Harry special is the way that he sees how energy, energetics, and um, science can be used to improve the physical and mental health of each person on this earth. Is that he is a rapid adapter. I mean, he also has such foresight. Like he could see what's happening in the world of bioenergetics before anyone else could. I sort of summarize sort of a life philosophy in these three principles. One is understand your world. The second is align your purpose. And the third is be the change. So. Um, if you actually want to, you know, bring something to fruition like a company or, you know, create a lot of wealth, by taking a lot of time into actually understanding the reality around you, the relationships, you know, how products or industries work, etc. Like it's really, really, really important because if you do that and then you, you could say align your purpose or your intention or your actions, use any of those words, if you actually align what you're doing with that better understanding, it's far, far, far more likely 
to come to fruition. Harry Massey is a health pioneer and a bioenergetics visionary. He is super positive. He's always operating in the quantum, in the realm of possibilities, and can always offer a really well thought out perspective on things or offer an alternative opinion, ways to look at things in a different way, which is something that I really appreciate about Harry. And now with myself, I ended up getting this reaction from homeopathy, but unfortunately I didn't get myself cured. However, what it did say to me is that there's something in this idea that a substance or a solution can have a memory. And I thought to myself, well, perhaps if you could use positive information instead of in homeopathy, negative information. Harry's a trailblazer. He has this vision for the future of health and wellness, and he's willing to do things to, to get to that future. And that future is providing health and wellness for the masses at, at a very reasonable rate. He understands that bioenergetics is foundational to good health. He's a visionary. What, what, what was the nature of the guinea pigism? I, I was basically healed. I've got one on my desk. So the, these are called an infosutical, which stands basically an information suitical. And uh, you know how he was saying that f fields govern your energy control system? So uh, we're um, specifically we're talking about in, an information field. So you can imprint information in um, basically into mineralized structured water. Uh, take that, and that that information is giving an instruction to your control system. As you start to get supercharged and use all of these alternative sources of energy outside of food your body ends up like this living matrix of energy where you feel like you have abundant energy for life.